All right, welcome back. It's Back to the Basics. I'm Sean Barr, and today we are talking net comp and Yang. Little data models for you. Let's go! We're back and we are talking NetConf and Yang, but before we get into that, let's talk a little bit about the history and how we got to this point. So, SNMP was designed to monitor and also push configuration to network devices. However, most network engineers just didn't find it that useful, so most people use SNMP only to monitor network devices. So, in comes NetConf. And the idea behind NetConf is to configure multiple devices, do moves, ads, and changes, basically control the configuration of network devices, either one-to-one -one or one-to-many. So in order to do that, though, you need a data model to follow, uh, a way that's consistent to get configuration from devices and push configuration from devices if they're different manufacturers. Maybe it's Cisco, maybe it's Juniper. If you want to push configurations uh, to those devices, you need a consistent model. And in comes Yang. And so Yang is the data model or the modeling framework of how you're going to pull configurations, how you're gonna get them, and how you're gonna push them to devices. So NetConf is a new, pretty new, relatively new standard. So is Yang. And it's being developed and you know uh, developers are starting to use it for monitoring tools for configuration management maybe you're writing your own tools to manage all of your network devices you're going to be looking at netconf and yang to help automate network configuration maybe you want to deploy a configuration to 100 devices netconf and yang can provide a scalable way for you to do that so netconf is the configuration management protocol yang is the data modeling so how is it the data going to be structured and formatted that's a real high level overview of NetConf Yang and the history behind it. If I said anything in this video that you're like, man, I'd love to know more about that. Leave a comment, like, subscribe, and we will see you on the next Back to the Basics. Thanks for watching.